What's going on everybody? Last time we worked on the exterior, we were able to fix the no reverse issue. This time we're going to be looking into the 4x4 light we have on the dash. Although it's not a drivability issue, it's really annoying to have it come up whenever the all-wheel drive wants to engage. I do want to add some mods to the X3, but before I do any of that, I want to get any mechanical issues fixed first. So what I'm looking for here is a transfer case actuator, and to get to it, seems like I need to get some of this heat shield out of the way, and that support bar removed as well. Let's get started. With the actuator out of the car now, I'm going to be taking this unit apart to replace a worn out plastic gear that's causing the 4x4 light to go off on the dash. This is the plastic gear I'm going to be replacing. So you can see it's been chewed up by the worm gear quite a bit. As a result, the gear will start to slip every time the all-wheel drive engages. And then that causes all, all of the ABS, 4x4 and brake light to come up on your dash. Before I replace the gear with the new one, I'm going to be cleaning up all the little bits of plastic from the old gear and grease everything up and put everything back together. At this point I already put everything back, the actuator itself and the two electrical plugs that hook up right to it. The heat shield and support bar as well. Let's get the X3 started right up. Moment of truth here. 4x4 light is gone. No other issues with the X3 for now, so I'm looking forward to the next video because I want to do a few mods on it. So stay tuned for that. I'll catch you guys later.